in the past couple of years especially when things have gone online there has been this huge buzz about the tier 3 tag you can see a lot of posts on linkedin which say i come from a normal tier 3 college and i'm currently working in fang so my college name never mattered in this journey yes that is true but is it the complete side of the story having studied in both a tier 3 and a tier 1 college today i'll break down a few facts and leave it up to you to have an opinion on whether an iit and it a triple it ka tag matters in your career or not I'm not going to discuss what you can achieve without a good college but in fact I'm going to discuss what things you miss out on if you're not from a good college. Before that, let me give you a quick intro of who I am in case you do not know me. I'm a freshman MTech student in Computer Science at Triple IIT Hyderabad and uh, I did my BTech from a normal college got into Cisco for a short instinct, qualified gate twice and then joined Triple IIT. Now, getting back to the main topic, a few days back I completed the first semester of my master's degree. So, let's talk about some experiences I had in the last 6 months apart from these dream jobs that a tier one college in India provides you. Number 1 is the handling pressure. Well, as soon as I came here, it was not long before I realized that every person around me is equally hard working and talented. So, the scope of being the best in the crowd is very less. And as they say, if you are the best in the crowd, then maybe you are in the wrong crowd. Apart from this the assignments in my BTech as in most colleges were a joke one guy used to write it and the whole class simply copied it zero knowledge gain and waste of papers but assignments here in triple it are pretty hard and practical i have probably seen more number of set faults in my assignments code than the total lines of code i wrote in my entire BTech combined there have been so many all nighters to fix that one stupid bug in the assignment but at the end of the day when you build something by yourself it skyrockets your confidence writing 1000 lines of code does not scare the shit out of us anymore be it managing four assignments parallelly the final project or preparing dsa for internships side by side we have seen it all in just one semester initially all of this was very overwhelming for every one of us some were not even sure if they'll be able to catch up with the pace of triple it but then we got used to handling this pressure and i bet you cannot experience this learning pace in a tier 3 college because 90% of the semester you do nothing and then in the last few days you pass the exams by just cramming up things number 2 is a collaborative environment everybody in my mtech batch is absolutely clear about why they are here and how they are going to achieve what they want in their career so i feel that nobody here is jealous of anyone else and whenever you get stuck at some place in the assignments or some coding question you don't hesitate in reaching out to the other person for help this way you learn from others and vice versa happens in fact during the recent placement season of my seniors here i got to know that the people who are placed remain in the campus and help their colleagues with their preparation until they get placed too this collaboration is the other side of the news headlines which show 100% placement record in triple it's This kind of environment in fact helps you grow as a person overall. I personally miss this a lot in my BTech where most of the people had zero hunger to learn and almost no direction of where they want to head on in their careers. Number 3 is the networking. Recently I visited Microsoft Hyderabad campus and that was only possible because one of our part-time MTech students Sumit Bhaiya is working there and luckily I had a course in common with him so he took us to the campus where I got to have a conversation with the engineering leads and technical architects of his team and some of them were in fact pass outs of Triple IIT Hyderabad itself now watching their work so closely and getting to know about the kind of projects Microsoft work on was in itself an experience i can't forget because when you see how good such workplaces are with your own eyes you get more motivated to work harder so that you can also reach there and i believe that all these things are only possible if you are in a tier 1 college because you can find your alumni in almost every company and this networking actually helps you to access things which are not easily accessible to a tier 3 college student Number 4 is having bigger goals. When I was in my BTech even dreaming about getting into companies like Google, Apple, Microsoft seemed like a huge thing. But the day I got into Triple IT, all of these companies started looking achievable to me. When you walk around in the campus and see people flying drones, wearing ICBC and internship t-shirts or big tech giants, you start having bigger goals for yourself and decide to not settle for anything less than what you can achieve. 
yes you can dream big and get into these companies from a tier 3 college too but everybody knows the reality that the off campus hiring of these companies is way harder than on campus placements and in fact i personally have faced it as well be it about the number of rounds or the resume shortlisting among thousands of people who apply the last one is the exposure and platform you might have heard of the famous startup scaler academy and interview bit the platform which most of the students use during their placement preparation these startups are founded by triple id hyderabad alumni who had two startup ventures while being in college itself before they launched scaler after passing out of college forget about the funding support even thinking of building your own startup venture in a tier 3 college is considered a taboo so most of us do not come here because of the package we would get but because the person sitting right next to you might be the ceo or cto of the next tech giant in india and hence having a proper skill set can help you reach your dream company but the amount of change you develop in your personality and your mindset when you enter the gate of a tier 1 college and after you walk out of the campus is so huge that it cannot be taught by any course of the world you transform as a person in and out and that completely shows in the way you represent yourself and so next time somebody says hey ti why it is so kuch nahi hota you might want to give that statement a second thought with this i'll leave you here today let me know in the comment box if you want me to create a video on any other topic until then take care of yourself and i'll meet you in the next video bye bye